Hello everyone and welcome back to another amazing episode of Archimedes Arcade. Once again, playing Chrono Cross. So we're going to hop back in our boat. Da -da -da. So, Glenn had mentioned that uh, there, there was a, a wizened gentleman. See, I can sneak into the back of our command. Uh, and I think he's on this island that's got the fire coming out of it. Eventually, I'll, I'll show off some of these other locations. Um, most of them don't have anything right now. Uh, we wind up exploring like all of them over the course of the game. But uh, this one uh, sounded like a pretty good place to start. So, Burned Out Hermit's Hideaway. I think I can skip this too. It's kind of fun. Like Glenn just like, ah, this is a good idea to go this way. And like, what? What on earth happened? Could Lynx have done this? That's correct. Mm, maybe not. The correct answer is I did this under Monsieur Lynx's orders. Zell, sirs. Did you miss more? Harl, what have you done with Radius? Ooh la la, Glenn, you're all fired up. Ooh. Tell me. <laughs> Excuse moi, sirs. But do you want to know why I burned this place to the ground? Not really. But yeah, tell me. Well, first of all, to teach you all a lesson. The second of all is to get rid of Zakiza who lives here. He is an ally of the Acacia Dragoons, and I heard he's quite skilled. I was disappointed to see that Giza wasn't here. I wonder where he is. And one more thing, sirs. Monsieur Lynx gave Moi one more order. That is to slow down your pursuit. Here I go. Harl. Metal Gear. What is going on? Dun, 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 dun. And then, take all the time you wish. Come on, Harl. Ow. How? 30. Jeez. Come on, Glenn. Uh, I think I'll do another round of hits. Oof. Alright, I think we got enough for an X strike. Yeah! Love that attack. Uh, see, the thing is, she is a black um, element type. So, I'm not sure how powerful this stuff will be. But the techniques are usually pretty solid no matter what. Oh, she's using white. Alright. Bushwalker. Oh, she's already hurt and wounded. Oh, she's good at dodging. Uh, we'll do arrow saucer. Might be enough. Oh, that's right, because I, I gave him that Pendragon sigil. Wanda, mine is defeated. Like, any time he gets hit by a, an element, like, he gains that power for his weapon. That worked out pretty well, actually. Uh, I'm actually going to catch this up needed. Photon. Ooh, I love Photon Beam. It's like Photon Ray, but bigger. Ooh la la, you really are strong. Trace Fort Surge. Well, that is the fun for today. Au revoir, Serge. Are you one of Lynx's minions? Radius, you are safe. Ho ho ho, is that you, Glenn? It's been a while. You seem well. I'm glad you are all right. Yes. 
Miss Riddell has informed me that links to the general were heading to Fort Tragonia. I played it safe and went into hiding for a while, and it looks like Lynx did pay me a visit. I'm sure the general has no idea what happened here. Lynx is one behind all this. I had a feeling something like this might happen. That is why I made sure to build a sturdy stronghold underground. I believe it should still be intact. Lynx must be plotting something. By the way, Glenn, who are these people? Oh, uh, they are. Well, no sense standing out here. Come, come in. Who are these people? I ask myself that every day. Hmm, I see. Do you know? Yes, I once wielded a sword as a proud member of the Acacia Dragoons. Glenn's father, Garai, and the blacksmith Zappa and I used to tear up the battlefield. Ho, ho, ho. But that was a good 15. That was just 15 years ago, dude. You look like 80. Uh, when Garai lost his life on the central continent, I vowed to become his son's guardian. I officially retired four years ago after Dario received his father's sword, the Einlanser. And I have been here ever since, living a carefree life away from the rest of the world. However, Dario is no longer with us. Life is so unpredictable. It was then that Lynx approached General Viper. He spoke of the legendary treasure, the Frozen Flame, which is able to heal all illnesses and fulfill any dreams. I do not know what this uh, man Lynx is plotting. But I believe General Viper intends to overthrow the nation of Poor with the power of this legendary flame. Poor is a nation governed by militarism and has brought on suffering to many people on the central continent of Zenan. Perhaps the general envisions a bright and peaceful world, much like Guardia was at one time. Or is he planning to find the answer as to why we have to continue to hurt and kill each other since antiquity? In any case, I no longer wish to involve myself in any conflicts. Besides, there is no way I would want to face General Viper in battle. Young one, should you plan to engage in battle with Lynx, beware, he is a fearsome man. I suggest you uh, rest here for the night and leave in the morning. There are many cursed spirits wandering the seas around here. Rumor has it they attack ships and suck the souls out of humans. Just saying. Hey! We went to bed! <laughs> we don't do that very often. Cool. Alright, any, anything in here? That's not nailed down? <laughs> it's like you gotta check every like jar and barrel too, because sometimes they hide uh, elements in them. Take care of yourself. Bye-bye. Have fun storming the castle. Oh, the flies buzzing around. Man, Carl, you really nuked the place. Ground is hot. Vegetation won't be able to grow here. So that is for when I have a, another special ability. I can come here and do a thing. Alright, well. That, um... Glenn, I don't... He didn't really help at all, man. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why he had to come here. but Alright, well. I think, let's see, how much time we got to burn? Oh, we got plenty of time. Let's just check this place out. I'm sure it'll be fun for the whole family. I mean, they don't just call these places the Island of the Darn for no reason. Holy cats! This is some berserk esque stuff, man. I found an eyeball! Ugh. Uh, I don't 
don't like this place. It's spooky and gross. And dude, there's just bones everywhere. Oh man, I don't know which bone is which. I found I found skelly bones. Hey, oh gosh, who does this? Oh, I suppose there's another path up there. Uh, let's, let's go check that out real quick. I'm sure it'll be fine. It's just tar pits. Like, there's literally elevated paths and archways of bones. That is sick! And really metal. Let's see how tough these guys are. <laughs> so I don't think I'm supposed to be here for a while. Airframe. Oh, please don't kill me. Holy snot. Uh, see you later. Yeah, I should not be here right now. <laughs> Run away! Oh, man. Glad Surge can just walk that off. See, thank, thank goodness I can just run away from every single battle in this game. It's 100% successful, too. Like, there's not, like, a chance that, uh... That I might not get away. i just use tablets. That should be good. Alright. Let's check out some of these other places. They were talking in Goldove a little bit about, uh... The Earth Dragon Island. Didn't they say it was full with sand? This is like, really rocky. The locals call this island the Earth Dragon Island, but it's known as the land where the dragon sleeps. Our investigation has revealed nothing. The so called dragon, the legendary dragon, must be a hoax. Mm. What you got here? Jump down in the big hole? Yes. <laughs> Those guys are just sitting there like, did we really just see that happen? All right, uh, I think I want to try and get off here. There we go. Can't believe people would actually come down here. Just curious or just stupid. <laughs> Sorry to be rude nature. Don't let it bother you. Uh, oh, yay. Surge found brace. Right, so I can't get back up out there. Lean down this way. Forget if there's any. If there's a monster. No other treasure. Oh, let's fight. Let's see how tough these guys are. Fossaker. That doesn't seem good. I don't like the look of that, guys. I think we should get out of here. Also, I barely did any damage to this dude. And that's like my strongest attack. Uh... Yeah, let's get out of here. See, that's, that's the thing is like they don't, since they don't have levels, it's really hard to gauge, um, like, 
when is it a is it right to fight these different guys? You just kind of have to like figure it out. Get some of this stuff out of the way. A capsule. Oh jeez. I don't want to fight that guy. Upheaval. Okay, yeah, so if I'm finding level 3 spells, then odds are I shouldn't be uh, really be messing with these guys just yet. But watch this. Sam Boyle Explorer's talking about it. It's not functioning then. Oh, okay. I gotta do something else to get it working. Otherwise, I could launch myself. It's pretty neat. <clears throat> yeah, I, I think we'll just kind of make this episode a quick run through of all the different locations. Um, not necessarily progress the story uh, today. All right, come on, Sur Surge, 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 do I? There we go. Huh. If it wasn't obvious, that's how you get back up. <laughs> wow! Okay. I thought he was going to be really amazed. That's how you get back up here. So, obviously, nothing to do here right now. Let's go check out the White Dragon Isle. Because we've, we've heard about that. Or Sky Dragon, sorry. What, uh, what creatures are here that I won't be able to kill? Now it's considered holy uh, ground by local residents. It's considered taboo to come near it. There is no such thing as taboo for the adventurous spirit. That is totally a lie. Uh, there's an island called where the sky dragon resides, but it seems to have gone away. Really? Let's go check it out. I guess there is nothing taboo for the Ameri or the adventuring spirit. <laughs> the American spirit. About a hundred years before humans on the continent came here, and Dragoon... Dragonians and demi-humans still exist in great numbers. Have I mentioned that the art is beautiful in this game? It's pretty great. Uh, and I think I've actually like run around this whole place before and found nothing. But look at that skyline! Isn't that cool? That's so cool. Yeah, this was this was the era of PlayStation games where we had kind of pre-rendered backgrounds and we had 3D characters kind of running in around them. Um, but it me we got like some of the best art, I dare say, out of that. Um, they, it, it's, it's that bridge between pixel art and um, uh, like, you know, 3D backgrounds and all that. Uh, I kind of don't want to go to the Water Dragon Island yet. Hey, we found the El Nido Triangle. Nothing here. That's fine. Let's, let's stop by Marvel. Um, so yeah, the Chrono Trigger. Oh, let's. Uh, I'm about to say something, but let's see if I have. Yeah, there's a little little mini of it. Get out, humans! Ow! Ow! Dude, right in the face! Uh, we don't want any humans here now. Beat it. Um. 
But what I was saying was that in Chrono Trigger, the big thing uh, was that the you were you were traveling through time. Uh, uh, sorry, I'm not really reading what this guy's saying because I want to tell my story. Blah blah blah. My point is, humans are bad luck. Thanks. For that. Um, but um, that you 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 travel through time and uh, and it's it's pretty fun. I mean, it's uh, buy something. Oh, okay, so these are all like status effects. In this game, we're doing a bit more of traveling dimensions rather than time. Uh, but what that kind of means is, I, I'll have to look it up. I don't know if this officially lands in any, uh, like a chronological order. Because again, if you're traveling through time, there's no chronological order. Um, but, you know, some of the things they talk about where, like, the poor military is hanging around and and coming into power does hint at a, sp a specific part of the timeline. Uh, so stay away, I don't want to talk to humans. Okay, I think if I came here with somebody else, that might work. Anyway. Demi humans don't like humans because humans are are crazy racists, and uh, and demi humans are animal people. Ruling elder, let me advise you: many of our villains detest humans. No crap. There is something you wish to know. It might be able to help. Only on the condition that you leave soon. What is it you wish to know about the Sea of Eden? I oh, want to know about the Sea of Eden, don't you? Poisonous leaves that cause instant deaths around the sea. I want heads near that shoulder. Uh, would not dare. Yeah, blah blah blah. Too dangerous. Don't go there. The rumors. Dragon God sealed it, and it was great. Rumor time. Sorry, sorry. May have already been. Uh, seeing the black dragon residing in our village. It has been asleep now. For, uh, there's a black dragon hanging out in your village. That's pretty rad. Uh, you mind if we check that out and show the kids? Just saying. Not to make a tourist trap out of your place, but I kind of want to see the black dragon. Dude. It's a dragon. Glenn, be very quiet. He's sleeping. He's a big kitty cat. That's so cool. I'm sure we'll talk to him later. But, uh, yeah, like, like I was saying, I don't know if it falls on any specific uh, timeline or, or points in the Chrono Trigger chronology. Obviously, it might, it might not. Uh, uh, it, we're, we're, we're going into more like back to the future kind of territory in this game. Um, and, uh, let's see what time is it. Okay, I'm just about at time. Uh, I think that covers most of the places I can go to. Um. Yeah. I think, real quickly, I'm gonna see if Glenn can get us into Viper Manor. Uh, cause I think there are a couple of things that I can access now that I couldn't before. I. There's a whole uh, area over here, actually, that uh, I haven't gone to yet, which is the uh, Shadow Forest. That's Fort Dragonia down there. It's so close, but yet so far. And look, you can see this the little island there. 
I'm smoking. How do I get there? Yeah. Uh, let's see if I can get in the front gate. I can always go through the Shadow Forest whenever I want. That's always there. Gonna let me in? Bye bye. Can I help you? Do nothing. I mean, I can fight it. Do I want to fight it? There's a treasure chest there. Uh, you know what? Let's save and then we'll fight it. apologize if I'm kind of breezing through this the story on this uh, it is one of those things where uh, back in the day like you were really engrossed in the story and, and sometimes they just I think kind of glaze over some points of like oh well go over here next but uh, yeah these guys are tough which is why I didn't fight them when I first came here I like this spell. It's fun. Eventually everyone like unlocks higher level technique spells. It's pretty great. But I figure right now is not a bad time to do some kind of light leveling up. Um, <laughs> Ooh, takes a hit. Um, because one of the next sections is a veritable gauntlet of uh, combat. Um, and so I'm just gonna I'm gonna putz around a little bit to see if I can uh, bring up my stats a little bit more. Yay! That's all we needed to do. Search and turn yellow. It was all yellow. So they've like more or less have evacuated the manor here, I think. I found an ointment. There really aren't any guards here anymore. So I just want to see you at uh if we can get to other places we couldn't before. Ooh, it's car sh it's a... Uh... Oh yeah, it won't open. There must be a way. This was Zoa's place. So that was the other thing. We met, we met these other D.Va characters. And... Um... Yeah, see? Now the, uh... Now the big monster blocking this way is gone. Oh, hey! This dude. Who she isn't here, she might be on the roof terrace. More importantly, can you let me out of here? I'll let you out, dude. <laughs> Still new around here. So I got lost and ended up here by mistake. Don't worry, I wasn't snooping around or anything. Really? Well, take care. You see that sparkling? Can I pick it up? Silver earring. <gasps> Look, it escaped. Escaped. Uh, I wanted to see if I think if I run around like this center, I still uh, get attacked. So I just want to see. Is this open now? Nope, it's locked. It's locked. Echo, echo, echo. Forgot that they don't have any music when you come through here. Afterwards, when it's not the sneaking mission. Oh, wait, here till heck freezes over. 
Now, where did that slacker go? Can't let him out of my sight. You mean the guy who totally wasn't snooping? Oh, what was I? Uh, sorry, I get really distracted, guys. Um, but I was going to say... Uh, Glad, what are you doing? I'll be accompanying these people. Um, I was going to say that the other divas that we met, Zoa, um, actually, yeah, just Zoa. Zoa, Karsh, and Marcy are the three divas. Um, because the fourth one is dead. Um, yeah, so that's fine. But, uh, the one of the other routes I could take to get into this place uh, would involve uh, fighting Zoa instead which is kind of fun uh, I think then the other way is Karsh through the front entrance let's bust this guy up oh come on I want to fight See if I can. I'll, I'll I'll speed this up, guys. I don't. Ooh, it's very pretty during the day too. I don't mean to waste everybody's time, but I don't know. I just want to check this place out again real quick, uh, seeing if it did have uh, anything more access. General Viper said to Fort Dragoon only southeast. The four divas, most of the dragoons, have accompanied him. It will be quite uh, difficult facing the poor military here. Yeah, so. So Lynx has convinced the general to just pull out all of his troops and take him to this ancient fortress. Um, that seems safe. That's what I would do as a general. Just abandon this place. Push the button. Push it. Alright, there's really only like one thing worthwhile here. Or two things. Is I can talk to Verdell. Oh my goodness, that night, you are the ones who did rest her life to shield me. My father and his men have left for Fort Dragonia. I do not know exactly where he is though. There is not a single thing I can do except pray for their safety. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Uh, General Viper tried desperately to persuade her his daughter to leave, but she refused vehemently. There's too many memories for her in this manner. Fond memories of Daria. Mm -hmm. She's dead. Oh, there's a little curtain. It's kind of a neat effect. It's kind of a little squiggly. Um, I'm debating if I should talk to Lucia... Um, just because I kind of want Kid in my party when I do that. I feel like she should be there. Hmm. There's got to be a trick. We took the fr uh, dragons too. Aha! Science. No. Oh. Literally, there's nothing. Curses. But it's a secret meeting room. Alright. Well, this was kind of a bust. But now the front door is open, so I guess I got that going for me. Yeah. I'm going gonna, gonna to head out of this place real quick, and then we'll wrap up the episode. Because I'm out of time for the day. But that's alright, because the next part is, like I said, it's literally a gauntlet um, of non-stop battles that goes on for like an hour, I think. Um... Or at least it's like an hour before you get to save. 
Um, so you really got to keep an eye on things uh, when that when I do that mission. So with that, I'm gonna take a break here. I know not a lot, a whole lot happened uh, this time. I was mostly just kind of exploring the the world. Now that we've now that we've got the opportunity to actually check out these places. Turns out I'm really underpowered to to go to most of them. So uh, it might be a while before we go back. But uh, thank you all for coming and checking out the video. Please give it a like and subscribe if you enjoy what you've seen. Um, hopefully next time I think uh, we might dive into the Shadow Forest there and see if I can get to that, uh, that smoky uh, location there. But uh, there is... I know exactly where we need to go to progress the story. Um, we can see about doing that next time or maybe the time after that. Um, either way, that might be a long episode. So, with that all said and done, have a nice night. Bye.